Hello everyone, it's Farkad here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to build a bridge using basic walls. And it's not like the sinkhole one. This one is perfectly flat, though it is not easy to do. It is more expensive than doing it with custom floors, though the benefit of this is that if they destroy any end, it doesn't collapse. And it also has a more unique look about it. So it might be more suitable for what you're trying to achieve. You can't build on this one either. Now it is difficult to do, and I cannot stress that enough, but you might find a use for it. So first, I'm going to do it over near the fertile lands near the big island area. I'm just going to bridge this gap between these two areas. So first, I'm going to get a custom foundation out, and I'm going to use it to mark where I want it to go. Now I'm going to be using a simple stairs to start it off, so I'm going to go about a simple stair height, and then I'm going to run it over, and it seems to be about the perfect height. So about here, I reckon. And I'll go the same width. Make sure it locks in the place. And I'm gonna run back over. You can climb up these rocks here. It's not too hard. Missed that. And there we go. Took me a few tries to get up there. Just line that up. And there we go. <laughs> 485 logs. So expensive. Get the simple stairs out. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna line it up as accurately as we can. Though that can be hard. Though it doesn't really matter as long as it's kind of on the ball. The longer you go, the more it will be off if you've got it wrong. But that looks... I'm happy with that. So I no longer need that. I can cancel it. Next, complete that. I'm going to get a basic wall out. Place it on the simple stairs. Then I'll get another one and try and get it to attach underneath. It can be quite tricky to do. There we go. And then I cancel this one. Now don't complete that. Whatever you do, don't complete it because you need to attach the next one. There we go. If you complete it, it does this angle thing where it stuffs it all up. So you need to complete one, then you can place the next one. So it does that thing where it goes above or below. I don't know why it does that, but it does. Just reach it. Just concentrate when you're doing this, because if you complete it, you're going to have a big bump in your bridge. So you need to get right on the edge. It's quite dangerous. <laughs> Good for those thrill seekers out there. And you just keep doing the same thing. You even go off to the side, but I don't want you something out. Or down. These basic structures are weird. I think this is how we used to build bridges back in the day before custom floors and stuff existed from memory. So I don't believe these techniques are something that's new. You could even build this over the sinkhole if you wanted to. I don't know why they've done it like this, but you know, guess we can use it. Almost fell then. I <laughs> uh, gotta be careful. I accidentally placed that one down there. Good idea might be to just go as far on the edge before you um, starts getting dangerous. Let's just go right as far as you can go. I'm not moving. Place it. Yeah, this is actually a lot better. <laughs> it's more safer. Because I actually know how much room I've got. It's a shame we can't really build on them because it would be cool to have it like a stick fence on the side of it. I do wonder if this is more expensive than the tree bridge. I think it would be more expensive. Though it's very similar to the tree bridge because we can't build on that either. But the tree bridge is held up by two ends. If one of the ends is destroyed, you lose your tree bridge. With this, it doesn't matter. Though it's hard to replace it because you can't get it flat again because you'd have to attach it. You can always just attach a tree bridge to it. All right, so we're at the end and I'm happy with that. I could probably clear that one. Now I'll build it, stuff it. And then I've got this much space. Now, what you can do if it's this tall, obviously it's not practical to, but you could do. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> Stairs are on its side. <laughs> uh, it's like that artwork. I can't remember its name, but yeah. Piss off, log. So what you could do is actually use a tree bridge to finish the gap. So that's a fairly big space. Place the simple stairs, and then I'll place a tree bridge. Tree bridge, attach that to that. There we go. And there's a bridge. It's 
pretty cool, I think. I like the look of it, though it's not very realistic how it's been held up. So with this, also, you might get stuck there, yeah. And I don't think the gap's big enough. <laughs> Attach a tree ridge to that. He can, but not to there. Probably because that's the bottom of it. I'll put it on, see what happens. Nah, I still get stuck. Oh well. <laughs> you can do all sorts of weird things. <laughs> I gotta touch a tree bridge to it. I don't know if you'd find this useful. <laughs> put it up a tree bridge, attach it to that, link it up. But yeah. So I cleared that simple stairs. I'm gonna replace it with a custom stairs. Because you can actually do this, you can replace it. So there you go. I've noticed with tree bridges it does this thing where it looks like it's up in the air, but it's not. I don't know why it's doing that. Must be a new thing. So I place a custom stairs there. There we go. Had to test it out. Take a log cut over it. It doesn't even like these custom stairs. I put it on a good angle too. And there you go. Glides beautifully along it. This might be good if you're building out in the ocean, you want to build a bridge, but you don't want it to be blocked underneath. You could do this. Or you could even build a dock with it. And remember, if you're struggling to get upstairs with a log cart, just head backwards on it. Backwards always seems to work better. If I'm getting caught on something, I don't even know what it is. There we go. I don't know if the developers had this in mind when they were creating this. So here's an example. Clear these walls. I'm still standing. It's floating in the air. Even throwing a bomb. It's still standing. I'm still standing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you go to replace it, where it's been broken, it's going to want to do this thing, where it places above. So I'm going to get blocked. It's not a huge deal, though it's going to block you when you're running. You might have to jump. As for log carts, it might hurt that. I only be able to place it above or below. So like that. Which kind of sucks. You also can't attach it to the other side, so like here, because that's actually the bottom. You could also attach a climbing rope to it. I don't know why. <laughs> it's on its side. You can't do anything with it. <laughs> oh, this game, man, it's funny. <laughs> he falls through it. <laughs> oh. I have a feeling that there's going to be a really good glitch that you can take advantage of with this. <laughs> How does this look? <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Oh, this is just, I don't even know this existed. I discovered, I just discovered this. This is great. <laughs> oh, why? Why fuck it dot exe is not working? <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> what are you doing? I'll just pull an anal weeds out of my mate's <laughs> Alright, get yourself together, fuck it. Jesus. Just to show you, you can't place anything on it. It just ignores it. There's no physics with it for some reason. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I can't get over that. <laughs> There's got to there's gotta be a glitch with it that you could take advantage of. I'm sure there is. Though I'm interested to see what ideas you could use for this bridge. Even though it's more expensive, it's actually probably more viable that you can build it in certain areas that you couldn't build elsewhere. Because you don't need to attach two ends. You just have to work from one end and keep moving forward, which is really convenient. Anyway, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers.